Yes, uh, solidarity uh, demonstration for the people in uh, Egypt who are protesting and giving their lives for democracy. So it's the solidarity with the people of uh, Egypt. I hope Mubarak will be leaving. Oh, I'm sure if they see that there are people around the whole world supporting democracy and, and the rights for the people, I'm sure they will be happy with it, yes. Uh -huh. I'm very proud of the people, but it's so dangerous because it's so strategic and so many big powers want to keep their hands on it. So that's why it's quite dangerous. What I would like to see that all the Western governments who are always talking about human rights and dignity and international law, uh, that I would look at our friends, at our dictator friends, and stop dealing with dictators only for their profit. For the power, for the money, for the influence in, in the, uh, for the resources, for the oil. Erhal, erhal ya Mubarak! Erhal, erhal ya Mubarak! I used to live in Cairo for about two years. I stand with the Egyptian people and I stand for democracy. That's what it is. That's what it comes down to. The Egyptian people are very kind-hearted people, very uh, hospitable. And uh, what I've witnessed is that people are very poor, yet they share. And that, that is very touching, that's very moving to me. Um, but also, like I said, they're very poor. So in practice that means that men, for example, can't marry until they're in their 30s, late 30s, 40s, even 50s. Because they just cannot afford to get married. This just interrupts the whole Egyptian society. It's shocking. And yeah, I just want justice and democracy for the Egyptian people. I want a fair division of wealth as well. Egypt, Egypt is, a, is a wealthy country, but there's such a small minority, especially the former President Mubarak, who is like a multi-billionaire, and there's people that are living under the poverty line. What's, what's, that's wrong. So that's why I'm here. People, I think, are here because we're all human beings. And we understand the pain of the Egyptian people. We're here in a democratic country. We're in a country where there's a relatively good division of wealth. And this is what we want for the, for the Egyptian people as well. And I think by being here and sharing this message, we can encourage the Egyptian people to stand for what is their right. Demo democracy. My message to the Egyptian people is be strong, stand for your human rights, stand for freedom, freedom of speech, freedom of expression, freedom, democracy first of all. Be strong, stand tall.